is up my lovely people um while i'm talking i'm gonna go ahead and uh, i've had this property since last night i never beat it so this is a tutorial on how to get um the uh, smart motion blur rsmb4 for adobe after effects so you're gonna go ahead and um go to this website link will be in the description and if you have windows click this if you have mac click this and after it's done you can um exit out and you search it and um and this will come up I'm gonna go ahead and um, minimize this one. And I'm gonna go ahead and go to RSMB. Um, and basically, all you do is it will come. Go ahead and uncheck these and then just click next. And you can go to program files. And you're going to go to Adobe. Um, click on this, support file. Go all the way down to this part in and click OK. Now you're going to open your notepad or it will be in the description. Type in Team Echo or highlight it. Click by clicking this and copy so I'm going to go ahead and copy it and then you hit control V then you hit this this is a common mistake for other people they don't tell you how to paste it because if you look you click on it right click it doesn't let you so you have to manually do it and click control V. Now we'll say install Pro GUI version. And I'm not going to do that because it will really mess up my computer. But basically, um, B. Or I can check it by going to computer. I'll go disk, programming files, Adobe, Adobe After Effects. Go to support files, plugins, and you will see this. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, give you an example how to use it. So when Adobe After Effects starts loading, when it's done loading, I will. Uh, oh wow! <laughs> it didn't want me to stop. So. I'm going to go ahead and click new, and then you're going to click import file or files. I'm just going to be doing a basic tutorial. Um, I'm using Apex's um, clip, and you're just going to go to effects. <laughs> you're going to make sure you click on it. Go to effect, sorry, and it'll say this. Just click it, and there you go. So guys, that was how to um that was how to get RSMB for free, and I swear in my life that I did not put it any viruses. I'll put this in the description, and then I'll let you download the um program from the official site. And how you know that Adobe um that I didn't this is a safe program because um, Adobe allows it to access it. It doesn't ask if, um, ask me if I want to um, if I want to allow it. It just automatically does it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video on how to get it for free because it normally costs a lot of money. So I hope you really guys enjoyed this video. It took me a while to figure out how to do it. So this is iTechFreaks signing off. Peace.